That's right, my dad's gonna be so proud. <laughs> <laughs> Chilaquile. Chilaquile. Burritos. Burritos. My dad's gonna be so proud. So we decided on this one. Chilaquilita. We decided on this one. Obviously, we had to have the Mexican in the family make this recipe. That's right. My dad's gonna be so proud. <laughs> because all of you know, and this is true fact, Tina is more Mexican than I am. Believe it or not, he looks more Mexican, but I am more Mexican than he is. I'm half, Danny's a quarter. We get that question a lot. So Danny's a quarter Mexican, I am half. So if you guys don't know what this is, I don't either. I've actually <laughs> never made this or had this, but we saw this recipe, I think on Facebook, and we're like, we have to make that. So we're making it for the first time with you guys. It is like a breakfast, I'm gonna say, right? It's usually, yeah. It's usually for, made, it's usually for, made breakfast. for breakfast. But you know, you can always have breakfast for dinner, which is what we're doing tonight. And I feel like you can have this recipe at any time, really. So. And and what it is is usually the chilaquiles, from what I understand, is just part of this. So basically. She's gonna go over it, but we're making it into a burrito. A burrito. Some people have the chilaquila in, um, chilaquila, <laughs> like plain by itself, right? Yes. Yes, okay. All right, so let me just tell you real quick what you guys are gonna need. You're gonna need tortillas. You're gonna need refried beans. You're going to need uh, crema, Mexicano. Crema. Mexicano. Crema, thank you. Thank Cre you. Thank Cre you, less Mexican guy than me. <laughs> crema. <laughs> Cre crema. Okay, maybe my dad won't be proud after he watches this. <laughs> okay, and then we're gonna have some salsa verde. Ver. Verde. Oy. Oy. <laughs> <laughs> and then you're gonna want some red salsa. You want both. Emberlyn, how are your ears doing? I'm sorry, I'm talking no. loud. <laughs> you have to talk loud when you make Mexican food. That was more Italian, maybe. <laughs> I don't care. All right, so then you're gonna need some chips, which I was thinking when I got these chips, I'm like, oh man, we should have had Danny make his homemade chips. Ooh, I'll have that to do that. That would bomb. So if you guys know how to make homemade chips, <clears throat> Use homemade chips because I think it would be better. But I'm, I'm surprised you got this brand. They're what they were like out of everything. No mission. No, no mission. Ooh, so no on like, the border. No on the border. They oh. were like out and they were out of like everything. I don't Dang know it. the new year. They're clearing. I don't know whatever. We need to do a Trader <laughs> Joe's. We need to do a Trader Joe's haul yes. and we need to get to. Uh, we need to get to um, Costco coming up. Yep, we got a Costco haul coming up. And we also got the. How do you say it? Cheddar cheese. Cotija? Cotija? Okay, cheese. All right, and then we got cilantro. Cilantro, cilantro, how do you say it? You just said it. All right, and then eggs. That's it. It's That's huevos. Huevos. <laughs> I need a some. What are beans in Spanish? Beans in Spanish is um, bean, bean, beans. <laughs> <laughs> Chorizo. That's not chorizo. <laughs> Beans in Spanish. Frijoles. Frijoles. <laughs> Here we go. So the first thing we're gonna do is heat up the chips. So what you're gonna do is put them in the pan, kind of crunch them up a little bit, and then just put them in the pan. You Danny's know that's my the, yeah. yeah. See. You know that's my texture right there, baby. Danny loves the crunch, so, so this good. will give it a good like crunch, crunchy texture. And for those of you who are new here, we've always got our dogs Benny and Jasper hanging out when we're cooking yep. because they help um, 
Pick up the scraps. Yeah, any scraps that fall, they're ready. They're, they do it, literally they're trained to help us out. So this is how you heat it up. Did you see how the guy did it on the thing? He oh, was like, yeah. I can't do it. I'm not a <laughs> professional. So we're gonna do this. Ooh, and oh nice, you got the wooden chunkla. Wooden chunkla. Oh. My hands are clean, don't worry. <laughs> Don't it's our that. house. We don't wear gloves. We do whatever we want. It's Noreen, not our house. Noreen says no gloves in your own house. That's right. Okay, so I guess we're going to heat these up. He did it all cool, though. He was like flipping it in the pan. I will be, I will make a mess <laughs> everywhere. <laughs> Are you just like touching the chips? Yeah. She's like... <laughs> I guess, you know, trying to crunch them up a little and, you know... <laughs> You're like tap, tap, tap. 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 I'm trying to crunch them as I'm doing it, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Okay. Boom. So, those look good, right? Does that look heated up? I don't know. Cool, okay. yeah, that looks good. All right, so, hey. Um, <laughs> hey, you leave my uh, handle alone. Uh, Get out of here. I did not realize that. I have that. this wooden chocolate. Oh, shoot. You should, should mush All right, I'm out. You don't make fun of my hand, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, the Mexican's coming out at me. <laughs> <laughs> this recipe's bringing it out. And I love my Mexican side of the family, so I'm not making fun. We're just having fun. Yeah, that's true. Okay, we're gonna crack the egg. Ready? Boom. Oh! oh. In the same Dang. pan. Oh. Oh. oh! Yeah! Everybody, <laughs> one more. And everybody watching right now, when she pop, when she cracks it, you say, "Oh, one, two, three. Oh! oh. You're doing that in the same pan as the chips? <laughs> what are you crazy? <laughs> oh, it's a face. Look, two eyes and a mouth. Looks like a duck. Oh, or we could do it this way, <laughs> and this is the eyes, and that's the hair. You know what I'm saying? Oh yeah, that's kind of cool. And these are the eyebrows. <laughs> Whoa, brow down. Brow down. Well, Be careful. Mouth? Yeah, that's yeah, Amber. That's right. That's where's true. The no mouth? mouth for this guy. Okay, so we're gonna scramble this up here. Just mix it all in. Mix it all in, baby. Check this out. Never done this before. That is so my type. Who's done this? Like mixed chips and eggs? Me? No. Like I would, I literally am gonna be doing this regularly. So the kids I better like it. this because they're gonna get this. And honestly, I will add a little chorizo in this. Oh my gosh. Oh man. You know what though? With this recipe, you could probably add whatever the heck you want. Yes, I'm gonna mix some things in there. There are no rules when it comes to cooking. You just cook what you like and you eat it. Yep, and you just you just get a name for it. All right, so we got that. So the next step is you want to mix the green salsa. Do you have? Do you, are you eyeballing this or? I am eyeballing it based on the video. So basically, I I'll, would say do a little less saturated because we like crunch. Okay. Okay. So we'll do a little bit of the green. Okay. Oh, that smell. You ooh, guys, salsa you know, verde. You know, verde. Trader, you know Trader Joe's salsa verde. It's so good. I'm trying to open the salsa. Oh my gosh. You're screaming today. I know. Sorry. <laughs> oh, I loosened it for you. That was, uh. Okay. That was actually kind of scary because I was on camera and I'm like, I better be able to open this. <laughs> that would have been awkward. Okay, so we're going to do the red and green salsa. So that's, I think that's pretty good. We're gonna mix it around and see how it looks. Oh, oh, that smells good. This is so, oh, it smells so delicious. Man. I'm gonna say though, this cheese, the Kajot, whatever cheese it's called, does not smell good. No, it doesn't. We were thinking like it smells like, um, throw up. Like uh, baby spit up. Yeah, it does. Yeah, it's but so hey, justified. you gotta add it. You gotta add it. It's in the recipe, guys. So, what do you think? You think a little bit more? Yeah, I'm saying a little bit more. I am too. So just kind of eye it, you guys, and I'm I'm gonna say you can have it as runny or as um, not runny as you want. Look at that! I I will tell you, this smells delicious. Wow, huh. that is bomb. Okay, so what we are adding to? What do you think? You want a little more liquidy? No, I think it's good, and I you know, and with with recipes like this, I've actually seen like three or four and each one of them was different different so it really is whatever your consistency that you want yep you do so i think this looks good some added some garlic some added some Ooh. onion some added you can add different things to Look it how amazing that looks though okay so we're gonna do the cajaja cheese whatever how i don't know how to say it so you're gonna add this to it 
We call it baby spit up, but okay. You're gonna add your it baby really spit. It really stinks. It smells, smell your hand. Woo! Okay, so there's that. And then we're gonna we're gonna put cilantro in. I wanna know who likes cilantro because I feel like with cilantro you either love it or you hate it. Well, I, it it's pointless to me. Really? It doesn't do anything for oh, me. Oh, I love cilantro. So I can never say it the right way, but cilantro. I say it totally That's fine. white. So look at that, that makes it so pretty, no? Si, sí, bonita. Si, sí, bonita, very beautiful. Okay, and then you're gonna take the cream. I wanted one of those like clear ketchup bottles to put this cream in because then you could squirt it out all nice. Nice. But we all know I'm not fancy. So here we go. Plop. <laughs> you can do it, plop it. Plop it like it's hot. Okay, just don't splatter it, it all still over looks the pretty. kitchen. Look. No, it totally looks Does pretty. Does this not look like such a pretty meal? Wow. Like that the looks colors good. in it is beautiful. That is bomb. So we got this. You guys, and if you want to know where this is, this is in the sour cream section of the store. Because I honestly I've never bought it, so I didn't know that. We're gonna mix this all together here. Boom. So we got the refried beans going here. These are obviously not homemade, but I will say homemade is delicious too. So if you want to make homemade ones, great. That or, works as well. Worse, you can always just go to Roberto's and man, Roberto's are so good. Mm, they have good refried beans. So do whatever. If you have time to make them, go for it. If not, whip up that can like so what, I am. So what's the refried beans for? Are they going to add into this? No, nope. so the refried beans is going to, we're going to spread it on top of the tortilla. Tortilla. So we'll spread it on top of the tortilla, we'll add this stuff, roll up a burrito and Ooh, so good. So good. I think it's gonna be delicious. All right, so with the, tor the tortilla, I'm going to just put it right on the burner and warm it up this way. Again, you can make homemade tortillas if you wanna make homemade. I, I've never made a homemade tortilla. Yeah, and we just heard from our friend Inez, how Inez rolls, that Costco yes. has some really good, like, homemade style tortillas where it's they're actually like, like the dough. Yeah, they're like uncooked, so you just heat them up and they, so I'm gonna get those. Next time we go to Costco, which will be this week, totally going to make those. And also, has anyone guessed who our collab is gonna be oh, with? Nobody's guessed. Nobody's guessed it yet. Okay, we got our tortilla all warmed up, and then we're gonna take these beans and just slap now, it. Can you say frijoles? Fri oh. Frijoles. Free. Frijoles. 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 So, and then you're gonna wow. just take it and thin layer. Thin layer of beans right here, guys. I love refried beans, but I'm not too big on like like in a burrito having so much. So nice. Oh, <laughs> taking it off. <laughs> I guess just that's kidding. mine. <laughs> so we'll just do this then. How's that layer for perfect, you? Perfect. Perfect. So you're gonna take that, and then we are going to get the wooden chancla and take this mixture, okay? Oh, looks so good. And we're gonna slap the mixture on here. Look at that. Boom. Look at that beautifulness. You need the slap and spread. No. I've seen them use the slap and no, spread I'm on this. No, I'm good with the wooden chancla. Oh, shit. Wooden chancla, oh, it smells so good. Okay, so this, and then you can go. Uh, un poquito más, por favor. I don't know. You want more? Yeah, un poquito más, Is that por what favor? you say? You want more? More? <laughs> a little bit more. Okay, more. Is that good? Oh my goodness. You want more than that? See. Si. We're not going to be able to roll this burrito up. Okay, <laughs> here we go. There's another slap and slap. Okay. There's a little, another slap, uh, slap. You're not supposed to show them that part. Oh, oh man. Should, might as well just put it back in my burrito. Mm, that's good. Really? Mm. I just licked my fingers. It's so good. So you can add more of the, um, whatever, cheese. <laughs> Just more, add, of, more of the matter. stinky stuff? More of that stinky cheese. <laughs> I'm assuming it tastes good because people use it in real life. And then you can just dot this. If you have your little fancy squeezer, go ahead and use that. Boom. Bam. Okay, okay and then you take it. Do you know how to roll a burrito? Watch me roll this burrito. Right, seriously, do you know how to roll a burrito? I know a how to roll a burrito. Let's do this. This is how I do it, anyways. 
Well, some people do it different. I could, should I do it how I normally do it or how they did it in the video? How they did in the video. Okay, so if you're gonna do this it This is like, a cook with me. We gotta look legit at Oh, least. no we don't. People know us, babe. They know we're not legit. Hey, okay, we're improving. Here we go, ready? Oh, this is heavy. So we're just gonna do both sides and then I'm gonna take this, okay? Oh my gosh. And then you're going to... It's okay if you get your hands messy. Yep, I'm gonna... Oh my mama. The guy in the video that we watched had gloves on. Well, he's at a restaurant. See, my sides came out. Damn. Oh no, that's still pretty good. Okay, so good. Boom. Oh. Check her out. We're gonna... Mm, 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 mm. <laughs> oh, that's so good. Okay, we got it all folded up. We're gonna cut this puppy in half. So you guys can see what the insides look like. Oh, check that wow. out. Good job. Thanks. All right, guys, I am going to try this out. This is gonna be so good, I can already tell. Okay, here we go, ready? That's legit. Is it crunchy at all or no? Mm -mm. No. I don't have a crunch. Yeah, that's okay. But I guess you could like not mash it as much if you want to keep the chip crunch. Right. Um. Mmm. That tastes like a real like Mexican. <laughs> it does. Here, taste it. Okay. All right, here we go. Oh my gosh. Good, right? Wow, it does. This like tastes like, wow. Like a total Mexican dish, no? Yeah. So much flavor. Like almost to the point where I'm like, was surprised by how much flavor's in there. Yeah, there's so much flavor. And I'm surprised that I, I totally like it even without the crunch. Because I can, I can taste the texture of the egg. Mm -hmm. the, the texture of the egg is not lost uh -uh. in it, and so it's really good. Wow. wow. I'm interested to see what Ethan says, you guys. Oh yeah, let's get Ethan. Okay. We got Ethan here to try this out. Let's see what he thinks. Okay. <laughs> it's so good. So good. You like it? A lot of flavor, right? Uh -huh. Yeah. Check him out. That's my boy right there. Puts a chip in there for some crunch. Yep. <laughs> That's Snuck right. Knock it in. <laughs> All right. Do you want one of your own? I can make you another one. <clears throat> so good. You had some, no? It was good. Dad gave me some of his. Oh, you want more? And, and let them know. He doesn't like egg or beans. Nope. And he's like, that was good. Yeah? Because you didn't, you couldn't really taste it. Like you felt the bean, I felt the bean. So like, I didn't care, like it tasted really good. Like what, I don't know what it was that made it taste so good. What else was in there? All right, here we go. Brayden's gonna give this a try. We're gonna see how he likes it. Yeah, it's really good. How good? Like really good. Like how good? 10 out of 10. What? <laughs> Do you like want? If we said you could have that half. Would you have it right now? Yeah. You can have you can it. Have it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> you can have the other half too if you're hungry. Peace out. All right, you guys. So that is it. That is our version of Chila Quila. Burrito. Burrito. So burrito. <coughs> so that is it, you guys. I hope you guys will try this recipe. It really is so delicious and so simple. Super easy. Just a few ingredients and really, really yummy. So. It's delicious and this can uh, this is like a breakfast one like she said yeah so you could have this in the morning you can have this for dinner you can really have it anytime you want but i think it is meant to be a breakfast type burrito but i think that's only because of the egg i think so too otherwise yeah it's not really any yeah. other yeah. you know nowadays they put eggs and hamburgers and everything and you mm -hmm. eat it whenever you want exactly so let us know if you guys try this out. I hope you do. If you do, let us know how you like it. So this was an awesome combination of food, you guys. Unlike yesterday's, if you guys watched that challenge or if you haven't seen it, go watch it. We did a crazy challenge where we did weird food combinations. Wasn't as delicious as today's Cook With Me though. All right, so that's it, you guys. Don't forget to subscribe, like this video. If you like it, give us a thumbs up and we will see you guys tomorrow. Do you miss me?
me at all Do you think about the things we used to do? No, you couldn't stand tall